Welcome back to the actual first part of Sonic Forces. Uh, we're actually playing the game now, so we're, we play the Sonic game, so we're playing on hard. Oh, you're hardcore. Oh. And Skyler's here, but he's just listening, so that's... This is this how really the game awkward. starts? This yeah. is how the game starts, the yes. It's too quick? You don't even have a fucking establishing shot? It's okay. It starts with Eggman saying, I hate Sonic. That's oh all you need. God. That's all it's the context you need. Dialogue. It's great. Yeah, he hates Sonic. He's in a room full of tubes. There's infinite in a tube right now for some reason. I don't know why. See, this is, this is, this is the thing, right? Before Episode Shadow, like, if, if, if you just take the, the main campaign as its own thing... <laughs> What? Fucking infinite, <laughs> infinite to me looks like a robot. Yeah. He's in this weird fucking tube. Like he has all this strange power. I legit thought infinite was a robot. Same. He does come off that way because he's in a tube. He's being powered by something that Eggman has, be it a creation or something he found. Uh, but Shadow, because you don't even see him entering the tube. You see him applying the gem in the Shadow story. With his hand, he's like, "I'm just gonna shove this on my chest. Look at me, I'm cool." It's a. Little oh, I love Sonic Generations. Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like. This is the sand mod. I got it off the internet. It's pretty cool. Oh, nice. Lost World Look Worm is here for some reason. the size of that. That's as big. As those, those are those fucking worms from Beetlejuice? Um, Desert Ruins in Lost World. I was gonna yeah, say and, and Beetlejuice, of course. <laughs> oh, okay. So does Beetlejuice take place before or after Forces? Uh, it, it's concurrent. <laughs> oh, okay. A Knuckles story happens at the same time too, and Eggman has budget concerns. Look, it's fine. Oh, okay. So, so they don't ever explain what happens with with Green Hill here, like. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, they don't ever explain why it is like turned into sand for no good reason. Gareth, Gareth, they never explain anything in this game. That's true. True, but Anakin Skywalker would hate this level. <laughs> It, 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 I say, Chris, 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 after, after I said that, put, put, put that applause thing on screen again. Why did you, okay. do, why did you applause at my terrible job? stop two seconds before you reach the end? So, I like doing a thing in Generations where I slide through the end of the level, uh -huh. and I yep. was trying to do that, look cool, and I fucked it up, uh -huh. basically. The the end screen animations in Forces are so, like, lazy. Like, compared to Generations where he's doing all this kind of crazy breakdowns and it looks really good. Everything about <laughs> forces is just is just third rate compared to generations. And Steven, can I get your opinion on the lighting? Like, it's not just an uninformed opinion to say this looks really odd, right? <laughs> no, this is terrible. Usually, when you put the when you put when you have an engine, you put the two at the end of it. It's like, oh, it's gonna be better. <laughs> Fucking yeah. Hedgehog Engine Two is terrible. Would you say it's not art? No. I mean, yes, it's not art. <laughs> Everything's art, though. Well, technically, it's not. It's just bad art. <laughs> Zavok. Bad art is subjective, Mister. Chaos. Oh, <gasps> uh, he's my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> I knew, I knew that would get stuff on. That was why I put that in. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh. <gasps> he turned to the side. Oh, wow. you know, it's, funny that, it's funny that because that exact same thing happens in Rise of Lyric. He dodged my spin attack. No one's ever done that before. Well, it, it, why does no one try and attack Tails when he's just sitting here on his laptop the entire time during this fight? They know he's a wimp now. They don't have to worry. He's like he's just gonna stand there and talk shit. We don't care. Yeah, you know that that might be <laughs> nice. There it is. You know. What 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 has happened to Tails in the last couple years in the main series? Because in Boom, he he actually gets to do shit, but in the main series, like I don't like how they've just turned Tails into this fucking wimp. You know. Well, I cool. mean, it, it it could be uh, a commentary on modern society. Oh wait. Back to our question. Jesus, <laughs> why aren't you doing something right now when I know that you can? <laughs> 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 oh, oh, Chris, you're this is on point, my friend. This is good shit. <laughs> what was that a clip from? That's this entire thing, so. I, it's some <laughs> religious talk, where he's oh. actually talking to Jesus. <laughs> I, thought it, I thought it was TEDx. This is... <laughs> this is so lazy. They couldn't be bothered to animate like a scene. It's like, and then all this shit happens, and now back to our story. The thing that gets me, they do have a scene later where Infinite's shooting up people. They could have just even reused that, I think, to be like, oh, he's fucking up the city that was also destroyed six months ago during Shadow's campaign. Look, don't think about it. It's fine. It's a good line. Why is Silver here? 
Well, hey, why are you here? Well, you actually, Stephen, if you read the officially licensed prequel comics, he just comes back and he's like, um, I think something bad's gonna happen. Let's maybe do something about it. And Knuckles is like, okay, I'll lead. I had bad digestion and I had a feeling, so I came back. That's right. Look at his mane. Wow. He's got... No, I thought that's his beard. He is old. Yeah, he is. He's in the future, so he's super old. Or is that super Why young? Is I don't. Never mind. Oh. Look, and Amy is now Tails. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Amy? <laughs> right? <laughs> Amy? Amy? Whoa, 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 wait! Um. <laughs> It's now time for the best part of the game. Okay, now. Oh, man. Let's see what Chris okay, makes. Amy's going to create... For this joke. Uh, is Amy okay, creating her perfect boyfriend? Oh, <laughs> oh man. That's... Well, she's, she's, making, she's making a girl, so she's okay, a perfect partner. Your girl? You're going to... Ooh, hey, it's a... Oh, like... Okay. It's a weirdly Most... full-featured thing, but I hate how the bear looks. I was expecting something that looks more like an actual bear, like a brown bear. Okay, you got... Not, oh, there's slight tufts on the back, which I should have expected, but... Okay, so we're gonna go um, with a cute doggy. Oh man, type you two. You made Goofy. <laughs> Chris, are you a Goofy Ken? <laughs> I, 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 I do like how behind her, you can see her giant head. Dead eyes. Yeah, I like how it updates with it. That's a neat thing, I guess. It's, it's a neat little touch. With, with, I would say the Avatar. It's it's you know I was I was against it when I thought I thought it was a stupid idea. I've come around to thinking it's a it's an okay idea, but I think the um, the execution in the game is incredibly lame and sloppy. It's that it, there's so many more things you could have done with this. Um, <laughs> one of my one of my biggest one of my biggest uh, annoyances with this game is the fact that. You can unlock like seven of the same thing, just just in different colors. I would have preferred you unlock one thing, and you know you can just change the color to suit your needs, rather than having to fill up your um your uh, inventory with like fucking seven of the same six things. I need five you know? gamer hats, Gareth. Um. Exactly, and it's it's, it's <laughs> six dumb. Crocs. It's real dumb. Mm. You need a Sanic shirt. What's the sit oh man, the sit no. rep. I I deliberately cut that out of this LP. <laughs> Good. I wish TJ was here. I put in a joke just for TJ. TJ, wherever you are, feel the synergy. It's How come all the anyway. boy characters are naked and all the girl characters are clothed? <laughs> well, you see, we, we live in a patriarchal society. What? Oh. <laughs> he said one piece, get it? It's funny. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Knuckles said that that's abuse. So the character creator isn't canon because you can make the male characters wear clothes. That's really fucked up. No. I mean, to to be <laughs> Chris, wait there, Chris, did you did you give the female character a a skin colored thing to make her look <laughs> <Yeah>. naked? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> to be so Chris I appreciate. Is equal, I appreciate Chris that the gun is bigger is, than her torso and legs combined. Whoa, Team Eggman! Chris is for equal opportunity. If if the men can be naked, why can't oh, the women? And the blood <laughs> washed over the earth. That was a little dark. To be fair, I kind of wish they kept the planet red. N none of yeah. none of the none of the female Sonic characters before are naked. They all have clothes. Uh, hello, my Not name yet. is Princess Sally Acorn. Except <laughs> for Sad <Set> AM. <laughs> oh my god! Look at those eyes. Oh, why does Why does Amy have a center mouth? Torturing him for months. Because um, I think you know what I, I think I think Amy I think it's only Sonic and Shadow have side mouths. Look at I Knuckles. Canon leave. Oh, and Knuckles, and Knuckles. But I think I think Amy and Tails have, all, have always been shown with center mouths. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> so, what's your avatar's name? Yes. Uh, <laughs> Yes, the animal. <laughs> yes, the dog. It's yes, the dog. <laughs> yes, the dog. Oh man, we're we're in the spaceport. Okay, so the second stage is chemical plant. Do you get it? <laughs> like the other two games recently that have a chemical plant in the second stage. <laughs> but it's a space. I love Sonic Generations. Port. Okay, so no, oh, wait a minute. I love so, Ratchet and Clank. This character is brought in <laughs> like too. this is a new recruit. They're like, okay, here's a gun, uh, a flamethrower. Just have fun doing anything is that <laughs> you have no training go off on your own on an incredibly important mission to find our leader yeah bye bye yeah and again i always i always love the fact that it's like this this no experience twat single-handedly helps the resistance defeat eggman 
<laughs> nice animation on the boosters, though. What kills me is that they have radio contact solely with each other, yet everyone can always see what the others are doing at all times. It's the future! Future radios! Right. Right, Amy made the video... <laughs> Wait, is it her idea? Did she say that? Well, Tails has completely lost it, David, so it has to be Amy. Yeah. Well, I mean, they could have stolen Tails' technology, like she raided his workshop in the Mystic Ruins. Just, just break in oh at night and say, like, he's, he's completely this lost it. is the Hedgehog it. Engine 2.0? Yeah. It's lighted. Jesus Christ! No, I, would, I, would, I would say these quick-time events are a good idea in theory, but um, for most of them, not all of them, and Chris, I like how you got the good, the good part, <laughs> but you still missed the red ring. Good job. But um, it's, it's yeah. most most of the quick time events, you can do nothing, and you, and you will still like proceed. Like yep. there, there was like no, there is no punishment except for like two of them. So it's like, what's the fucking point? And that bothers me because then it's inconsistent. It's like pick a side and yeah. stick with it. But to go back to go back to what Steven said, it's like it is weird how. <laughs> Like how how everything in this game looks worse than Generations and, and Unleashed, even though this the, the, only, the only plus this game has 1080 is the, 60. Uh, 60 frames. With, yeah, yeah, which which you know I won't lie, it, it does. I I I can't really remember running into any like frame issues. Like it does run pretty smoothly, yeah. but um everything like all the, my problem with the textures is that so many of them remind me of Sonic Heroes. Everything's just like bright. And shiny, you know. What's going on in the background? Yes, everything, everything looks plasticky. There's no real sense of like, for for a game that is trying to evoke more of a kind of mature slash dark and gritty like aesthetic. Also, please they, don't do that in a Sonic game. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> but um, it's it's why would you then have everything be so fucking shiny everywhere? Chris, I was uh, Chris. I will say I I sneaked ahead in this bit. You you did a fucking edit here, which made me laugh more than it should have. And I hate Hi, you. Omega. Is it the blink? It oh, man, I remember oh. when I met you on the Dreamcast. Wait. Oh, <laughs> fuck you, fuck you, Chris. <laughs> I'll listen to the music. There it is, guys. Chaos hasn't been seen in over ten years, and he gets twatted in a cutscene. Good job, I'm getting, Sega. I'm getting angry. Well, technically, he fuck was that. in Lego Dimensions. Shh, that's just not canon. Shut up. Okay, one thing I will say: this, this, <laughs> <laughs> this might, this might be complete and utter bullshit, and it most likely is. There was a Reddit thread um, a couple months ago when they were talking about the upcoming Sonic movie. How it was apparently supposed to be out roughly now. I think the original, you know, the original release date was like some point in early 2018. And apparently, in, in that version of the movie, which has since changed, Chaos was going to be the main villain. And so Sega just put Chaos in this game, and it's kind of like, hey, look, movie, he's going to be in the movie as well. Remind everyone he's in the... <laughs> 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 um, and so that, that if that's true, then Sega are dumb for not doing anything better with one of the most beloved villains in the franchise. No joke, Wait. one of the reasons I bought this was to see what happened with Chaos, because Adventure was my first game. Like, of course I want to see what the hell is up with that. And I love that's, Chaos, man. That's what's up with that. Thanks, Sega. In, oh. in that last cutscene when Sonic showed up, did I did I hear a... Yeah. It's the Mania theme comes back for uh, because this is... Plastic's introduction, which is, which is a nice touch. It's a nice touch. Yeah, that's a nice touch. Too bad it's a 10 out of 10 Too bad it's me. ruined by this level. <laughs> too bad it's ruined by this level. And all of Classics levels. Oh. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm gonna say right off the bat, everything with Classic Sonic is fucking trash in this game. I'm not used to hearing stuff like the way, not like the way, the way he on? controls his level design is terrible. His music? His music has really bad memories. Uh, not memories, uh, melodies. I will give them slight props. <laughs> this is the first time in any, any Classic Sonic game where they've kind of somewhat successfully emulated a Mega Drive sound. So yeah. I'll give him props for that, but the the melodies are some of Tommy Otani's worst. It, these are pretty bad. I like this one well enough, but this is is probably the best of a bad bunch, but it's still not that good yeah. to me. Yeah, like Tommy, I love his stuff, but like, what the hell happened? <laughs> Chris, to go back to what you said, I'm I'm nicer to this game than most people, but with classic, of it's, course you are. Yes. Because I I find some enjoyment in both the Avatar and the modern uh, gameplay, but with classic, it's just like nope. Of course you do. No. Well, well, we'll get to it when we get to it. But this is just 
<laughs> oh man, something interesting's happening in the back. Oh, I guess and no, not. That, that, no, that that that's no. this whole game is something interesting happens, and nope, nothing happens with it. Yeah, uh, the fact that the fact that the fact that the first teaser is fucking modern and classic about the face off with the giant death mm -hmm. eggs. You don't do that, but spoiler alert, there's a moment in an in upcoming level where Modern Sonic takes out an entire death egg with one home and attack. Oh. <laughs> it's what? like, if, 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 if they are that easy to defeat, why can't Modern spend six seconds to just destroy them all? Yeah. You want some... No, that's the power of teamwork. Uh, okay. <laughs> Chris, that's your excuse for everything. Oh man, a couple well, of months Sonic ago... Well. <laughs> oh, nice. we're gonna play some Sonic R? Oh. I like how you're keeping the music in the cutscene! <laughs> so this cutscene irritates me, because Infinite's like, Oh, okay, you know, if you run, I'll let you live. And you are... the, the shot ends on a hang shot or whatever of, like, the character just sitting there with this fucking facial expression. Alright, so two months ago, he's like, I can't even shoot the gun. Oh. I like this. There's a cutscene in a Sonic game where a scared, I'm gonna assume a scared child is pointing a gun at a flying <laughs> monster and is like crying to himself. What the fuck is this game? Well, it's, Animate it's, them running! It's called Sonic Forces. It, it, it was released uh, last year in November. Uh, the only Sonic release last year. <laughs> Roosh! I mean, if Sega had their way, it would be. She says that so casually. It's like, yeah, he's been better. They're gonna banish him into space. Well, by banish him to space, do they mean just like throw him out of an airlock or oh. what? The unleashed him again. I think. Oh, right. Because he can breathe in space. One. I don't know if you really now that that line that that torturing line from what everyone who has researched it have said was added into the English script. Right. What? There was no. So I guess Pontac and Graf are like, you know what this, you know what this story needs about a cartoon blue hair jog? Six months of fucking torture. Wait, That's Pontac what and Graf worked on this? Yeah, Pontac and Graf. Pontac and Graf did not write the original story. They they adapted it. Well, that's what uh, they always the, the do. Adaption work. As, as like colors as know, and what? generations are also them just adding in. <laughs> <laughs> There's what. <laughs> Please don't. It's taking me so long that I've gotten Frankie in the FTCR. Let's go get him. Right. Wait, where's Sonic? <laughs> go get him, Avatar. Uh, he's, there. he's there. Oh. He's in. Wait, I thought I thought the Death Egg was destroyed. Why is it there? He rebuilt it. Yeah. <laughs> Somehow, no one noticed again. I mean, well, I I made I made this death egg too in the uh, in the chance that Sonic broke no, free. No, the death you egg two was in master, Sonic the piece. Fighters. Well, yeah, and this is no, the death, death, death egg three. Egg no, 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 death egg two is in Sonic the Fighters. Death egg Mark two is in Sonic Four Episode two. Not to mention the death egg that is in Sonic Drift two and Sonic Battle. Uh, the one in Sonic Four Episode two also wasn't destroyed. That's true. Oh, good, good point. So they blew up Little Planet in this game? No, because this design is definitely not the same design as Episode Four or Sonic so, Four Episode Two's Death Egg. And if Skylar David. was here and able to talk, he could give us some insight as to what happened to that additional. Because he egg. made this game. Well, as a developer on Sonic. 4. Uh, yes, as a developer in Sonic Four Episode Two, he could have explained the design choices as to why the Death Egg looked different in that game uh, related to the rest of the games. You know, we can't count the one in Generations because since that is a time travel extravaganza, it is just the same Death Egg from Sonic 2 that was previously destroyed but had not yet been destroyed because time was all messed up. But look, but I think what we're really trying to say here is that classic Sonic, yes, he says he's from an alternate dimension, and yet he recognizes him because he engaged with them in Sonic Generations where it was clearly stated he was from the past. Because I having... Clack. What? Oh. Classic Sonic doesn't say that he's from another dimension. <laughs> Everyone else says that. Ah. Classic he just knows, like, I, like, I don't yeah, care. Yeah, classic sounds like, I I don't want to deal with any of you. Sure, was... if, that, if that's what you think. Uh. Whatever makes you sleep at night. <laughs> I think maybe... So one the... thing I like oh. about this level is that the red eye is in the background. That's a good callback. Right. The eye of sorrow? Very cool. Yeah, yeah, that's a good one. Right, because if, if you do that, then you can be like, well, it can still be one single timeline, because Classic Sonic is purposefully mm -hmm. keeping himself... Uh, away from spoilers about his life. Even in Generations, mm. he doesn't learn all that much. He just knows that at uh, some point he's going to be running in a city. Yeah, but David, yeah? Are, do you consider some Sonic games non-canon? I always consider Generations non-canon. No, I mean, 
I, I think it's pure canon. Yeah, it, it, no, I consider it a non-canon. Oh, it's sequel the end of the to level. Colors. Uh, well, why would it be non-canon? Because it's fucking stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm I guessing prefer, you don't. I prefer... <laughs> Am I wrong? I mean, <laughs> well, no. Well, Stephen, in that regards, the entire Sonic franchise is not canon. Everything in it is fucking stupid. Exactly. Oh, yeah. I, I Why prefer, are we doing this? Say, can we just, just can we play something better? I just want to say because it's the end of that part, the, the track that plays in that level, the opening piano chords. If you sync that up with the song "Empire City" from Steven Universe, it syncs perfectly. Oh. <laughs> also, shout out for having a Sonic song. Talk about anxiety. Finally. Hey, we hate our lives. Join us in part three. Oh, okay. Oh, David, David, you never talked. We 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 didn't continue our conversation. Oh, we'll do, we'll do it part, part three. Part. We're gonna start a conversation. We ended in part one because it, this is also out of order. Just like stop FTCR. recording, you bastard.